Hello everyone, I'm Dr. Anirudh Jagannath, Consultant Pediatric Neurosurgeon at Rainbow Hospitals. As we know, the pediatric brain tumors can present with headache, headache associated with vomiting and awakening in the middle of the night, sometimes associated with imbalance while walking and sometimes with seizures and visual disturbances. As Dr. Vasudha said, the treatment uh, depends on the location of the tumor and the type of the tumor. Surgery for pediatric brain tumors is complex. However, with the improvement in the technology over the last two decades has made these surgeries extremely safer. The aim of the surgery is safe maximal resection of the tumor without damaging the critical areas of the brain. Sometimes these tumor can block the water pathways in the brain and can cause something called as hydrocephalus where there is water accumulation in the brain. In such situations, we do a VP shunt or endoscopic third ventriculostomy, which is a bypass pathway for the fluid to flow and then take care of these tumors. The advent of microscopes, uh, CUSA, uh, tumor fluorescence and intraop neuromonitoring and such adjuvants uh, during surgery helps neurosurgeons to get rid of these pediatric brain tumors in a better way and improving the outcomes in these kids. Depending on type of brain tumor, the further management is decided after discussion with a pediatric uh, hemato-oncologist, pediatric uh, neurosurgeon and the pediatric neurologist. The teamwork is the most important part of managing these pediatric brain tumors. For any further queries, don't hesitate to contact. Thank you.